All right, we're joined now by head coach Austin Parkinson. Coach, uh, talk a little bit, a little bit about this game. It was a great start to the game. Uh, absolutely explosive first quarter. The defense was moving. The offense was really uh, working in transition. Then you got to the second quarter, a little bit of a, a speed bump there. Talk a little bit about the struggles in that and what you did at halftime to adjust. Well, I was really excited about how we came out. We talked about coming out aggressive and, and moving the basketball. We shot the ball very well in the first quarter. And then the second quarter, um, you know, we had some careless uh, shot selection. Um, they forced some turnovers. And then they did a really nice job, which they do in transition. Uh, they made us pay. And uh, so we had to regroup at halftime. And I felt like the kids did a nice job of stringing stops together in the second half that uh, allowed us to get a cushion. Seemed like it was a later half of the third quarter that they really uh, started to turn it on. Then obviously an explosive fourth quarter. Uh, it's it's a team that, I mean, they've shown a lot of resiliency along the way. Um, they've had to deal with a lot of different looks from a lot of different teams. Uh, you guys now cap off a perfect 3-0 homestand. How good was it to come back to the jungle and be able to play here after a rough road trip? Well, you know, like you said, it was a tough road trip. So to be able to come back and hold court, we needed to do that. It was really important, and it was probably even more important is we got back to playing good defense. Um, and I think, you know, if we're going to be successful on the road going forward, you know, we've got to be able to do that. Um, I thought Danielle was excellent tonight. She's had back-to-back -back games where she's shooting the ball from outside. She's had balance around the rim um, and really played at a high level. And, and, and that's what she's capable of. And then the other thing I thought was key tonight is our point guard play. I think they had 21 points and eight assists between the two of them. Um, and they really guarded their point guard well. Um, you know, she plays a lot of minutes, and, and we were able to get up and pressure them. And so, you know, if our point guards can continue to do that, it's really going to be a benefit for us. Yeah, I think one of the, the things that really shined on this team was, uh, you know, you have a dominant player like Michael Rogers who, who's able to get down low and create a lot of work. She was in foul trouble for most of the night. Uh, you know, it created a little bit of a difficulty, but your team still managed to, to be able to rally around her absence from the lineup for a, a fair portion of the game. Yeah, I mean, you know, anytime you lose one of your top players to foul trouble, it makes it a little bit more difficult. But I thought Alex Brown in the second half uh, played well, knocked down a big three for us. Uh, and I thought Jenna Gunn looked a lot like, uh, you know, we've seen uh, in the past. Um, she's had a couple struggles the last couple games, but she had great energy tonight. She was active uh, on both ends of the floor, a couple big charges for us, uh, you know, down the stretch. So uh, it was a good win. That team's a, a young team. Um, but she does a nice job uh, with their team, and I think that you're going to see North Dakota State continue to get better as the year goes on. You're back to a winning record in Summit League play. Now you have Western Illinois coming up. The first time you played them, very chaotic, chaotic rather, uh, defense. What are you looking for in the rematch with them, and what do you need to uh, build on the week of practice? Yeah, Western's uh, probably the most explosive offense in the league in regards to their shooting, um, and their defense, I think, is very underrated this year. They create a lot of turnovers. Uh, we're going to have to go on the road and take care of the basketball. If we turn it over quite a bit, um, it's going to be tough for us to go in there and win. But we got to take care of the basketball, continue to play defense. And, you know, we've shot the ball well. Hopefully, hopefully that continues. Coach, appreciate your time. Thank you.